Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And today in our tech news, we have Google that um, actually has analyzed the uh, different zero days that they actually found in software and even hardware um, and basically came up with a report on the 2023 uh, zero days that it found. And it's, of course, Google's uh, threat analysis group, which is very active and often finds uh, threats for other software. They have found some zero days for Windows, Android, for Apple, uh, for iOS on iPhones, iPads. And they, their report that came out is very interesting because it states that basically the threats, the zero day threats that they have discovered uh, 80% of all these threats come from malware vendors. What's that? That's or spyware vendors, if you want. That's bad guys selling, you know, all the tools necessary to exploit zero days within software. So a lot of them are close to governments. Uh, a few examples were given about uh, Italy, uh, Israel, and of course, um, other uh, countries in there. Russia is uh, big, uh, China. But the uh, they are saying that most of them are actually really big vendors that are specialized in selling kits that exploit flaws to all sorts of, you know, agencies and bad guys. Uh, they say that only 20% are kind of more of a random type of zero day that, um, you know, was exploited by other smaller groups. But it's very interesting to see that, you know, there's a market for that. There are um, vendors of spyware uh, and that uh, they are active in selling uh, what is required to exploit uh, any flaws that are discovered. So zero days, uh, of course, are uh, flaws, security flaws that are discovered in software or hardware and that are exploited already in the wild and that don't have any fix. So a zero day doesn't have any fix or any cure to it. Um, and of course, that means that it is important to make sure that you update your devices for that reason. That's why we update Windows, we update the software that we have on our PCs for security. That's the best way to stay safe. It is updates. Your antivirus has almost no effect in um, zero days. Often it will go through and pretty much all antivirus will not even see it. You'll just be infected and that's it. So that's why updates are the number one thing to do. Uh, they are much more important. That combined with what you do is 99% of your security. So 80% uh, are specialized spy spyware vendors around the world that uh, just sell kits to exploit the flaws. And one last thing that I still see a lot of people saying that, you know, malware viruses are made by antivirus company. No, they are not. And if one antivirus company would do that, uh, we probably would know about it and they would really, really not be very popular. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.